Hey guys, it's Keith here from johnsiphone.com with a video for you guys today on how to speed up your iPhone, iPod Touch or iPad using a great little tweak from Cydia. So the tweak is called Speed Intensifier. And what it does, it opens your like apps or whatnot a lot faster. And I'm going to show you what it does and how it, well, I'm going to show you what it does and how to get it. So at first, you're going to want to go into Cydia. So now Cydia's loaded, you're going to want to hit search. A little slip up there guys with my iPod going on standby. Well, so you're going to want to hit search. And then search, speed, intensifier. So as you can see, it came up once I added um, once the search speed, but I'm just gonna. Well, I've put that now anyway, guys. So as you can see, I've now got speed intensifier after searching speed intent. Well, intent. So you're gonna want to hit speed intensifier. So it's gonna say install for you guys, but it says modify for me because I've already got it installed. So what you're gonna want to do, you're gonna want to hit um, install, and then go through that process. So about the sneed, um, sort of sniffing guy's got a bad cold, as you can tell. So once you've installed it, I don't think you have to respring, but I don't know, guys. So anyway, if you do have to respring, respring, and then go into settings app, you'll then get a little tab called Speed Intensifier. Hit that. As you can see, it says quadruple your expectations. So what you can do, you make, you can make it slower or faster. Which, if you ask me, making it slower kind of defeats the point of the object, if you know what I mean. So what you're going to do, it says 4, 3, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10. So if you want to make it 10 times faster, and I tell you it goes fast, just hit 10. And then, just respring. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you a few of them. First, I'll show you 2. As you can see, the little dot in between minus 2 and 2 means just put it back to normal. So if you hit 2... You're going to want to go to your home menu and then just respring. So, for me, that means having to slide to power I off. I apologise if you heard some noise in the background, um, in the background, guys. Just a minute, well, just 10 seconds ago or something. Just my little brother being a horrible little boy again. <laughs> so, anyway, once you've re well, once you've resprung, if you go into settings, you'll still have your speed intensifier one. But as you can see, it does make it faster. So if I go into make it mine, for example, and go to my home menu, it goes to my home menu a little faster. I mean, it's not as fast because it still goes slow because I'm jailbroken. But anyway, so that's two. You don't really notice a difference with two. But I'll tell you, if you go to ten, then you'll notice a difference. So if I go to ten, and then respring, guys. As you can see, there was a respring button on speed intensifier. But it doesn't work for iOS 4. So now it's um, respawn guys. With 10 times the speed. It should go a lot faster. So we'll see. So let's slide unlock. As you can see that came on a lot faster. I'll just show you that again. Yeah you can see it comes on a lot faster. So if I go into settings. Just for example. And just go back to my home main menu. As you can see it sort of does that a lot faster. So you can see the actual idea of it guys um, most people might think that it doesn't work because you know what I mean just well you know what I mean but um, it does work actually it's pretty good as you can see when you go into multitasking it sort of like stuns it and comes on you see guys it's so normally it would slide upwards but it just, it just comes straight on you know what I mean so yeah guys that is speed intensifier thanks for watching I'm Keith from johnsiphone.com and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.